the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So I've been seeing comments regarding how to get candy. What is the fastest way? So here it is, guys. But first, you need to load this new island. Again, from the Loaf Island. This is the Loaf Island. Just turn left when you're facing the Loaf Island, okay? Turn left. Here you go, and you will find this island. This is the Limited Island. I think this is a Limited Island only. Halloween Island, okay? So in this island, you can buy stuffs, accessories, new accessories, four accessories. I'm gonna show it to you. There are four shop owners around this island. So here they are. First one is located here. And for 500 candies, he will sell you the hollow lamp. 500 candies. Don't worry, I'm gonna show you how to get those candies. Next up, this one. This one is selling the hollow shawl for 750 candies. Two more. On top of one of the castles, tower castles, this one sells the pumpkin head for 1,000 candies. I think this one's good. Next up, for 1,500 candies. On the other side, just the other side. Oh, the dragon fruit user is like looking for the shop too. Pumpkin Smasher for 1,500 candies. So if, wait, I think the Pumpkin Smasher is the weapon, the new sword. Okay, so we have three accessories, one sword, and that is the Pumpkin Smasher. Where is the fourth accessory? You can get it from the Sea Beast. I think this is the Sea Beast skull. Okay, so there you go. Three accessories, one sword. So where do you get candies? Two ways to get candies. First up, Sea Beast. I'm sorry to check the Sea Beast now. The skeleton, sea beast. <laughs> so you can get, from my experience, 5 to 10 candies from the sea beast, okay? So I fought tier 1, 2, and 3 sea beasts. I, I only got 5 to 10 candies. So here you go, as you can see, 5 candies. On my other accounts, 10 candies, yeah. On my other experience again, I think it's only 5. There you go, 5. So is there other way game or no? Yes, there is. Every three to six hours, this will appear. It is Halloween time. When that appears, go to the Halloween Island, the boss event, Jack o Lantern level, I think it's 10,000, will appear. Okay, so you're gonna need to defeat it. Game or no, can you do it solo? No. Maybe you can do it and you will defeat it in like two to three hours. Here you go. Jack o Lantern. It is hard to defeat one on one, but with lots of players from public servers, etc., you can defeat it easily. Okay. So compared to Sea Beasts, I got 20 plus here. 20 plus gems. Can you believe that? I'm oh, sorry, not gems. Sorry, sorry. Candies. 24 candies. No gems. 24 candies. Sorry. 24 candies. There you go. So this is equivalent to like two Sea Beasts. So you can check it here with this NPC 24 candies. But Gamer Nom, you already earned candies from Sea Beasts a while ago. Guys, it didn't count. I don't know why. But the developers, I think, is fixing it right now. Gamer Nom, how about the Black Swordsman? No, you cannot get candy from it. See that? How about Big Mom, the new boss? No. No candies from that. So, the only way to get candies is from Sea Beasts and Jack O'Lantern. Next up, Gamer Nom, how do you get candies fast? If you're gonna ask me, just do Sea Beasts. Do server hop. And there is an item in the shop wherein you can... Summon Sea Beasts, okay? But you need to buy it and it costs 20, 275 Robux every summon, okay? So again, guys, just do server hop, Sea Beasts, and you will get lots of candies, okay? So I hope that will help you. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is Gamer Gnome. Gamer Gnome out.